by Margie Pelletini, illustrated by Barry Moser. The Three Silly Billies. The Three Silly Billies. The Three Silly Billies by Margie Pelletini, illustrated by Barry Moser. The Three Silly Billies were ready to kick up their heels and have some fun in the sun. They packed up their old jalopy and with a spit, a chug, and a honk, off they tootled. Down the hill and through the woods went the billies until they came to a small wooden bridge that crossed a very deep, deep river. Clackety clack, clackety clack, clackety clack. Who's crossing my bridge? shouted a grumpy Stumpy little man who was blocking their path were the Billies, Billy Bob, Billy Bo, and just plain Billy, explained the biggest Billy, who was Bob, were revved up and ready to roll. Hold your horsepower, said the little man with a stamp, a stomp, and a snort. This is a roll bridge. Troll bridge. I'm the troll. Now start passing the buck. A buck? Said just plain Billy. But that's four quarters, ten dimes, twenty nickels, a hundred pennies. That's one whole dollar. This isn't a freeway, said the greedy, grumpy little man. Just show me the money. Billy Bob had 30 cents. Billy Bo had 20, 20 cents. As usual, just plain Billy had no cents at all. No matter how they added up, the three silly Billies did not have enough money to pay the troll. But the middle Billy, who was Bo, had an idea. What we need is a carpool. We can share the fare. So Billy Bob opened the trunk. Billy Bo pumped up the pool. And just plain Billy fetched some pails of water. With a splish, a splash, and a slosh. The three silly Billies grabbed their rubber duckies and jumped into their carpool. Oh, just wait and wait for someone to jump and join us, said Billy Bo with a bob. The troll grumbled. Crazy kids. He shook his head at their silliness and stomped back to his troll booth. And then clackety clack, clackety clack. Clackety clack, who's crossing my bridge? shouted the troll. It's just us, the three bears from the other side of the river, answered the big papa bear. We're taking a walk through the woods before dinner. Looky here, Teddy, said the little man with a stamp, a stomp, and a snort. All you'll be eating is dust from the tour du jour. Unless you start coughing up some coins. Oh dear, said Papa Bear, looking in his wallet. I only have one thin dime. Oh my, said Mama Bear, peeking into her purse. I only have one wooden nickel. Baby Bear cried. Don't count on me. I don't even get an allowance. Troll grunted, then take a hike. Mama Bear fretted. Well, ever will we do? If we don't get home soon, our porridge will be cold. And I hate cold porridge, said Papa Bear with a worried sigh. Why not add your money to our money? blurted out Billy. Makes a lot of sense to me, said Baby Bear. We're on 
are my water wings. So Billy Bob added up the moolah. Billy Bo held out the pot. And Papa, Mama, and Little Baby Bear jumped feet first into the carpool. The water ju was just right. I still say that idea is all wet. Mumbled the troll. He shook his head at their silliness and stomped back to his troll booth. And then, clackety clack, clackety clack, clackety clack. Who's crossing my bridge? shouted the troll. It's only me, Little Red Riding Hood. I'm on my way to Grandma's house. Oh, you can kiss sing Granny goodbye unless you have a bill in that basket, Missy, said the little man with a stamp, a stomp, and a snort. Can't you see the sign? Oh my goodness, a big toll you have, signed Little Red Riding Hood. But all Little Red Riding Hood could find in the basket was one crummy quarter, a gooey nickel, and three sticky pennies. Hey Red, don't be blue, called out Billy Bob. Pull your resources with ours, ours so we can cross the bridge together. Come me in, said Little Red, making a big splash. Beautiful party animals, grumbled the troll, shook his head at the silliness and stopped back to his troll booth. And then, clackety clack, clackety clack, clackety clack. Who's crossing my bridge? shouted the troll. It's just Jack. I'm bringing my poor mother some magic beans. I traded for our cow. Beans? Maybe a royalty check, Junior, said the little man with a stamp, a stomp, and a snort. The boy held out his hand, but all I have left are these beans and two pennies. Then hit the road, Jack, shouted the troll, spilling the, bean, the beans into the river. Poor Jack didn't have a clue what to do. Don't worry, kiddo. All about Billy Bo. Oh, call the help, Billy Bo. Putting the two cents over here. So splish, splash, and jump Jack, who plunked down his pennies and topped off the pot. The troll stamped and stomped. He stormed and sweat. He snorted and cavorted until he was blue in the face. I want my money, he four-legged Batinskis. He sh shouted, tramping up to the carpool. Give it to me now, now, now! Mama Bear raised him, an eyebrow at such behavior. You know, my little fellow, I think you deserve everything that's coming to you, the troll snorted. So let me have it. Billy Bob, Bill, Billy Bo, who gave a nod to just plain Billy, who pulled a plug, everybody out of the pool. Whoosh! Man overboard. Man overboard! Called out Billy Pop, tossing the troll a spare tire. And as the grumpy, greedy little man glugged and gulped, Jack, Red, Papa, Mama, and little baby bear waved goodbye and floated safely across the other side of the river where they hurried home to meet their mother, visit Granny, and eat their porridge.
the three silly billies turned over the pot and dropped every last penny, nickel, diamond, quarter into the troll, troll booth. Blink, plunk, clink, clink, clunk. Exactly one dollar. And across the, the small wooden bridge, across the very deep river, went the three silly billies from some fun in the sun. Which would be the end. But then... Clackety clack, clackety clack, clackety clack. Oh, who's crossing my bridge now? Rumble the troll with a soggy sigh and a gurgle. Just little old me, below the giant with a sniff. Fee fi fo fum. Is that a troll I smell? Yummy, yum, yum. Under new management.